finding the significator in the four worlds. This is your advanced intuition practice. I have my deck. I have my query. Here I am at the end of my, at the end of our workshop, at the end of my presentation today, I'd like to give them something, you know, something to tie it all together, something that can really send them home on fire, motivated, you know, I'd like them to, to just really be enabled when they leave. This is my intention, my motivation. I don't really know. I've been waffling on for three and a half hours. I don't know how they've taken it. Uh, I don't know what they're feeling. I don't know what they've understood, but I want to give them that one thing that will really drive the whole workshop home and tie it all together. What do I do? You know, I was told that the significator today is strength, but I'm going to say no to that because I always associate myself. I enjoy associating myself with the magician for so many different reasons. And I believe that right this moment, if I could give these guys anything, it would really be a stroke of magic that, that drives that point home. And I don't know how to do it sitting in this particular place I am right now. I have no idea where I'm gonna go next because we're done. And I have stymied them with all of this information at the end. And I don't wanna send them home stymied. I wanna send them home fulfilled. It would really take a stroke of magic to do that. And hence I am the magician and I must be the magician. I must come at it from that perspective. So that is my significator, the magician. And I am going to divide this deck into four decks representing the four realms, the four worlds, the formative, the emanative, creative, and the manifested. I've got these four decks. And if my intuition is spot on, then I should be able to determine which of these worlds my significator is in. So am I talking to them? Is my query based on an emanation, a creation, a formation, or a manifestation? I, I really, really want it to be in the world of manifestation. I, I'm going to send them home in about five or 10 minutes. It really, really has to be physical. It really has to be understandable. It really has to be relatable. And so this is the world of formation. My significator must be in this deck. And so I pick up the deck. I just check and make sure, yes, there it is, first card, the magician. How we do this particular operation is, first of all, I associate myself with one of these cards. Now, where I am at the end of this workshop right now, I still want to call myself the magician for a variety of reasons reasons that only I know and I identify with. And where that magician is in this deck right now, I have absolutely no idea. Now I'm gonna ask a question to this deck, to myself, and that is how might I offer even more value closing this workshop? How might I just bring everything together and really, really impart that final piece of magic that sends them over the top, that, that fills them up with a sense of, wow, these cards really do have some kind of potential to lighten up my way. How can I show them best? And what I'm going to do is I'm going to divide this deck now into four worlds, the emanating world, the creating world, formative world, and the manifested world. And it's up to me now to know myself as well as my operation to such a degree that I should be able to determine which of these decks my chosen significator is in. Now I want to believe that I will be able to deliver on my promise or on my desire which is to raise a particular impression in you, encourage a particular impression in you. I want to believe that I want to 
believe that I am enabled to manifest this right now. And hence, I would say that my magician card should definitely be in the world of manifestation. Well, here comes the challenge because if it's not, then what does that mean? Well, anyway, this is the, this is the choice that I've made. I am the magician. It is in the world of manifestation. These cards right here are going to show me the answer to my question and I'll spread them all out. So let's just check if I am on target with my, and I'm totally not. Magician is not in the deck that I thought it should be. Hmm, okay. So what are these cards trying to tell me? Where would this operation be? Because I've done this two days in a row now. I know what I'm doing. I know why I'm doing this. What is it? Is it still, is it now just a bunch of head play? Am I still in the formation world? Am I, am, am I not really manifesting? Am I just thinking about it and playing games with myself? Yes, that is precisely what I'm doing because there it is in the formative world. I was stuck in my head. Okay, so my first choice was off. My assumptions were wrong, and here is where my integrity and objectivity comes into play. I know what I wanted to show. I know where I thought it should be. It wasn't there. Okay, what are the tarot cards telling me then? Where is it? It was in this world. Mm -hmm. 